Hey everyone, it's Frank from Brilliant the Epic, and this is part 7 of my Resident Evil Code Veronica X Let's Play. So, last week we got our asses kicked by that kind of mini boss thing at the big at the middle of the game. I don't know if you guys can tell, I'm I'm just getting over being sick. Uh, that boss kicked my ass so hard that I got sick from it. So, yeah, it's it's pretty impressive when a, a boss is so hard that it, it it can make a video game do that. That's yeah, I was pretty shocked about that one. But uh, yeah, so now we're in Antarctica, and Chris might be here, but we're not sure yet. So let's go explore. Yeah, so coming up here is one of the most annoying enemies in the game, as I pointed out before. So uh, shut up, cutscene. Yeah, it's right there. It's like a moth thing, but they poison you. And there are pains in my dick. Let's see if I can... Kill it without getting poisoned. Yeah! I did it. Did it. And uh, I'm pretty sure, yeah, this thing grows back. So you can, if you do get poisoned, there's a planter right here where you can just heal yourself. That's very convenient. Um, older Resident Evil games would not have done that. Just giving you kind of an unlimited poison heal. But they're not all over. It's I think it's only in that one location. So, uh, yeah, for the most part... Going forward, I will get poisoned, and don't want to do that. I want to equip this, save some pistol ammo. Uh, yeah, if I do get poisoned, um, if I am in that area, I can always heal it for free. Otherwise, I'm just going to have to uh, use a blue herb that I have. And I, I, have a, I have a fair amount now, so I, you know, I'll be okay for a little while. But, uh, yeah, that's that's one thing that you really, uh, really want to be careful of. I've actually never... I don't know if poison kills you eventually, or... Fuck you. Oh, dude, come on. Don't be like that. That's a... That's a... That's a dick move there. Yeah, I don't know if poison eventually kills you or what. I've never actually let it play out to, like, whatever it does. I've always healed it immediately because I'm just that good and I've never run out of blue herbs. So, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty fucking awesome, but, uh... Yeah, I don't know. Maybe just for science, I'll let it happen and just see what happens if you let yourself get poisoned. I don't know yet. We'll see. Alright, so I just need to get my bearings a little bit because it has been a while since I played this game. Uh, okay, so there's an item up there. You just saw that flashing. I believe I want to go this way now. Or no, no, I don't want to go this way, but I'm just double checking. Yeah, it's locked. Okay. So, yeah, it's always, you know, it, it tells you on the map immediately as you enter the room, but I always like to just double check because I'm like that. Uh, and... What's up? Oh, I can't get... Oh, no, I can. I just gotta go around. Uh, there's something with this conveyor belt later on. There's, like, you drop an item down from up top somewhere and drops onto that and you do something with it and uh, something. Thank you. Yeah, no, I, I saw the flashing before, but thank you, game, for just making it blatantly obvious that I will not miss that. Fuck you, 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 fuck you. Damn it. Yeah, so going for... Okay. I was about to say, oh my god, move. Oh! Like fucking LaShawn McCoy over here. So, uh, yeah, preseason... Or not preseason. Football just started the season. Uh... Like, literally right now, as I was setting this up, I was watching the kickoff for the uh, Packers-Seahawks game. Uh, so yeah, I got football on my mind, especially with the new Madden that came out. I did a review on it and stuff. So um, Yeah, check out my Madden review. It's, it's actually a pretty good game. I don't know. Uh, I honestly... Fuck. I honestly don't know like what the demographics are of people who play Madden. I know personally that... I've always been kind of a sports fan, so I don't buy sports games every year, but I'll definitely like play them if I go over a friend's house or uh, if a friend of mine gets one or, you know, whatever. So I don't think they're worth it to buy every single year because it's it's like, you know, basically paying 60 bucks for mostly the same game. You know, they do add stuff, they do make improvements, but for the most part, it is the same game that you're buying, $60 every single year. Uh, but this year's Madden is actually... God fucking damn it. This year's Madden is actually pretty good. Um, you know, I said some in my review. It's not, it's not perfect. I gave it a brilliant. But 
Um, you know, for the, I know there are. Oh my god, get the fuck around the box. This room is kicking my ass. There are three zombies. They're destroying me. This is why I really hate the bowgun. It, it just sucks. Yeah, I'm already at caution. Uh, but I want to save the pistol for other enemies because, you know, increasingly we're getting to the point. Oh, cool. I can use this. Increasingly we're getting to the point where new enemies are going to be introduced and zombies are going to start falling off and we're going to see them less and less. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, still, uh, still feeling the effects of that boss fight. Kick the shit out of me. Yeah, um, so we're going to start seeing zombies. Oh, fuck yes. Uh, I'm so happy I just found this. AK-47. Although, I don't know, according to like Black Ops, this might be an AK-74. I don't really know what the difference is. Oh, 47. Okay. I thought the 47 had a stock on it, but I don't know guns at all, so I could be wrong. I'm just... All of my gun knowledge calls comes from Call of Duty, so, you know... Not necessarily... Oh, okay, I think... Yeah, I need this. Not necessarily an expert or anything. The zombie's obviously gonna get up. Or he's not. Cool. Um... Yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, so zombies are gonna become less and less. So I, I wanna try and save my better weapons for, uh... When I don't have to fight... Or save my better weapons for when I don't have to fight zombies, yeah. I want to kind of... Do I have to trigger this or... Yeah. Oh, heat sensitive explosive. Um, so how do I do that? Uh, that's a good question. Maybe I do it later. I will come back to that. Yeah, this is the point of the game where I, I start knowing less and less about what I'm supposed to be doing. Um... So, it's, it, you know, these Let's Plays might take a little bit longer. I might start slowing down, and I might lose the uh, breakneck speed that I was I was just beating shit before in the prison. Because the prison I know pretty well. And Antarctica, I don't. It's uncharted territory. But yeah. Madden 15, pretty good. You should get it if you're a football fan. Yeah, if you're not, you're not going to like it. That's... Pretty much obvious, I think, but still. Okay, so this room. Okay, I'm gonna brace myself here because... Because, I'm ready. Yeah, see it? They fucking spit acid. And... Fuck. Oh my god, they're... Oh, Jesus. Okay, okay. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, oh god. How is it not dying? Uh, is it gonna kill me? Woo! Alright. Uh, I didn't really plan for that to take so long. Uh, yeah, so I mentioned before that I fucking hate spiders. I have arachnophobia and, uh... Hate these enemies. Fucking hate them. Luckily, they're not as prevalent in this as they are in other Resident Evil games, but... Oh god, still, it's... Ugh. Hate them. Come here, you bastard. Come here, you bastard. Fuck you. Whew! Yeah, so, uh... It's a little tough, not gonna lie. Hate spiders. Hate spiders, man. I, I just... I don't know what else to say. This, this room creased me out. Oh, God, I want to get out. I want to get out. Go away. Go away. Go away. I don't know if you can kill that one underneath. Um... Wow, that didn't even bring me up to fine. Yeah, also the spiders can poison you. So, um, I think it's it's not, you know, it's not a guaranteed poison. Like, the, the other one that hit me definitely spit acid. Let's see. No, it doesn't hurt it. There is a way to kill this one, I'm pretty sure. Or I thought so. Maybe not. Yeah, oh, okay. I guess if explosives don't do it, then nothing will. Um, but yeah, the other one did hit me. Yeah, duh. Take both of them. The other one did hit me. It sh hit me with the poison shit, and it bit me or whatever. Um, I guess it's not a guarantee poison or whatever. Maybe it's... Uh, it, it. You know, luckily, it doesn't happen every time. So I think with the moths, it might be guaranteed every time. But with this, it's not. Uh, yeah, so eventually, I'm going to fuck with this room more. But that's kind of the initial go in there. So 
Yeah, those enemies aren't that common, but still. Fucking hate them. Ugh. Yeah, I made playing Zelda very, very hard as a child. I will say that. Because, uh, you know, Ocarina of Time, great game, but the Skulltulas were fucking everywhere, man. Uh, I need power. Push the switch. Okay. So, yeah, as you can see, there's a lot that I just don't really know what to do with yet. Uh, damn it, the moths. Yeah, the moths respawn pretty, uh... I think they respawn every time you go in this room, to be honest. Which fucking sucks. Uh, I don't know where this last one is. Oh, no, no, no. I hope I didn't get poisoned. Good. Okay, so it's not every time the moths hit you. Uh, I guess it's just kind of a, a percentage thing. I don't know what the percentage is, but... If you do get poisoned, I think you start limping, even if you're at full health, so it's usually pretty easy to tell when it happens. But I'm going to grab some more items and put some stuff back. So what don't I want? I don't want this yet, actually, because this was pretty ineffective against the spiders, and I tore through a lot of it already. Uh, what else? Wow, I only have one herb? Shit. Okay. That's not good. Uh, I'll keep that. I'll keep that. All right, and we're back. I'm going to add a jump cut there. So, um, yeah, just still searching around the menu, trying to figure out what I want. So, uh, let's see. So, yeah, first aid spray. I'll take a poison thing. I have no grenades. It looks pretty good. Yeah. At the bow gun for spiders if I run into them. Yeah. Fucking mini bosses, man. Also, if you're listening to this, uh, just a quick suggestion you may want to. Yep, they respawn every single time. That sucks. Yeah, I'm poisoned. Okay. So, uh, I don't know if poison gradually kills you or what the rules are with it, but. Uh, it's a pain in the ass. So, I'm going to go down here and use this planner. Luckily, this is right here. Yeah, nice. So, I'm healed. But, yeah, as I was saying, you know, if you're uh, if you're watching this and you don't want to get sick, you may want to just kind of keep your distance from your computer or iPad or iPhone or Android device or whatever device you're using to watch this. I would just, you know, maybe turn the volume up all the way and put it on the table across the room from you and watch it that way because I probably am still contagious even through the internet. So, yeah, watch out for that. I don't know. I'm not a scientist, so I don't know. But I'd be careful. You know, I'm just, I'm looking out for your well-being. I, I know you have a lot of work to do this week. And get rid of that. Fuck you, mining key. Yeah, and I just, I care about you, man. I really do. I really do. I really do. What's in here? Okay, ice. Ice is in here. This comes into play later. Uh, I don't know if there's actually anything I can do in here yet. But this comes into play later. And there's like a cutscene and stuff. Poison gas. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Yeah, as, as I play this game more, it'll come back to me, but... You know, this is the first part in the Antarctica. I keep saying... When I was editing last week, I, I, I noticed I kept saying the Antarctica. And it really pissed me off because that's not... It's Antarctica. It's not, you know... I kept saying it too. And it, you know... It's when you go back and edit it and you, you hear yourself acting stupid that you get pissed off. But, okay. So, this is the first episode in Antarctica. And I'm still... I, I still got to get my bearings a little bit. Is that a dog? That is a dog. Um, yeah, I don't trust myself to hit these things with the bow gun because they're too fast. So, I will waste pistol ammo. Yeah, the pistol is actually pretty useful now that it's been upgraded to semi-automatic or whatever. Um, you know, you don't want to use it on anything too dangerous. But I think you can actually upgrade it further. So, you do want to hold on to ammo for the most part. Um... I think. I could be wrong about that. But the pistol is pretty pretty useful th throughout the entire game. Uh, please be a green herb. 
I would love you forever. Oh, uh, yeah, 420. Yeah, you know, green herb. Marijuana. It's a joke in there somewhere. I've made it before. Oh, dog, why? Why were you sleeping? Now you're sleeping forever, bitch. More green herbs. Nice. Uh, I'll just use this one. Yeah. Use it now. Yes, I will. And we're back to good health. And this room was a treasure trove of herbs. So, all around, good experience. Let's see. Oh, one more. Sweet. Okay, let's do this. Um, I will be getting poisoned from now on, so I'll do that. I don't think you can add a red to that. It's possible you can, but... Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure that once you mix a blue and a green, you can't add other stuff to it. So I just want to kind of uh, be careful with that because, um, you know, I don't want to I don't want to waste all my blue. I, I think you can also no, you can't use a blue herb by itself. I think could be wrong about that, too. Um, and, and now that I say that, I actually have no idea. So disregard that. But if that's the fact, then that would really suck because if you're poisoned, you don't have a green herb, then you're just fucked. So. Yeah, I, 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 either way, I just want to be careful. I don't want to combine all my blue herbs with something already, uh, especially because there is a boss battle coming up that involves poison, and that actually affects the end of the game. Uh, can I turn this? No. What are you looking at, Claire? Uh, dead dog. Uh, I think I'm done in here. Yeah, looking like it. Yeah, there's a boss battle coming up that involves poison, and it actually affects the outcome later in the game. So, I'll talk about that more in length when I when I get to that part. But basically, shout out to water. I would be drinking like beer or something because beer is good, but I can't because I'm 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 a sicky poo, I'm a little sicky poo, so. Got to be drinking, you know, plenty of fluids, as the doctor always said. Don't have juice. Well, no, I have orange juice. Well, I finished it, but I had orange juice. Uh, where? Oh, yeah. Okay, so I turned on the power. So this thing should work now. What the fuck? Really? Seriously? I just... Uh, uh. Do, I, do I flip this first, or... Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, actually, I'm a dumb dumb too. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, uh, this is a way to kill the spiders in that one room without actually having to fight them. You just run in and get the sticker, then get the fuck out. Um, so I wasted a bunch of ammo in there and stuff, but that's fine. All right, so how the fuck? I turn on the power in here. Yeah, how the fuck do I get this? Can't operate that. There's not really anywhere else I can go. Yeah, that door's locked up there. I've been in there. Been in there, been in there. I am confuzzled. Yeah, I turned on the generator. Now what? Yeah, this this makes for such a good let's play. Uh me doing something and then running around going, what the fuck did that do? And then trying to figure out for like 10 minutes. Uh, so hopefully it doesn't take that me that long. Hopefully I can figure this out pretty quickly uh, so that I don't have to like, you know, do a bunch of, do a bunch of, sh oh, here we go. Here we go. Okay, cool. Yeah, pro tip, uh, if you're ever doing Let's Plays, the, the less, the less dead silence, the less like dead air, dead silence you have, the less cuts you need to make and that means the less work you need to do in post-production i say post-production because i come from a film background but mainly that just means editing so you know the more concise i am with where i go the less i'm just wandering around going like what the fuck do i do the less work i need to do when i'm editing it i can pretty much just put it into uh i use adobe premiere shout out to adobe premiere i got it for free for, through school it's usually like 500 bucks I actually don't know how much it is. Uh, it could be like a thousand for all I know. 
Anyway, editing software is expensive. I got it for free. Um, so yeah, I just put it into Adobe Premiere and pretty much do some signature Frank touches to it. Uh, that's the secret. That's a brilliant epic trade secret. Can't share that with you. But, you know, do a little bit, then export it. And it takes like four hours to export. But, yeah. That's the secret. So, okay, that thing's going in there. Um, oh, wait. No, no. Okay, now I flip this. But yeah, the less, uh, the better you are at just keeping things moving, the less work you have to do later. It's a pro tip if you're ever doing Let's Plays. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that, that goes in here now. And this should be filled with gas. So there'll be a gas mask I can get here. Yeah. I don't know what would happen if I like hung around in here with the gas. It'd probably kill me eventually, so I want to take that chance. Uh, combine, use, check, what? Or maybe this gas isn't poisonous to humans. Maybe it's just poisonous to spiders. Or maybe it just like hasn't had a chance to seep into this room or something. Ah, fuck you, dude. Okay. Well, either way, I got a gas mask. So I know that comes in handy later. Uh, for now, though, where I go next is a, a good question. Oh, you know what? I'm, I think I could probably go back here. Because there's that thing with the uh, blowing open the safe or whatever, and maybe now that the power is on, I can do something in here. Oh, yeah, that'll that'll do it. Remember, it said it was heat activated. I guess turning on the power caused fire. Yeah, there we go. That's what you want. The Magnum. The Magnum is an awesome weapon. Uh. It is the strongest gun in the game, I'm pretty sure. Even stronger than, like, the grenade launcher, even. Um, but I might not be able to get it yet. Which totally sucks. Okay, so I can't go in here. So the question now is, where do I go? We'll figure it out. Hmm. Yeah, let me think about this. Did all this shit. Can't do anything there. Went in there already. Alright, so let's go back. Um, yeah, I don't think I can do anything in the save room. So, yeah, these things respawn every time. Pain in my ass. They're also impossible to hit. They're just like the bats, but they poison you. I don't think they do as much damage. Like, base damage. Um, but, it causes you to waste ammo, and... Oh, that's how they poison you. Okay, so there's like a fucking thing now. Uh, yeah, it like lays eggs on you. It's pretty gross, actually. Stop! Prick. Um. Okay, so I don't know if they'll like hatch eventually or what. What do they do? Is it a green herb right here? This looks like a green herb. Oh. Does not look blue, buddy. I would not call that blue. Uh, let's just check in here real quick, because I want to drop some stuff off anyway. Okay, so yeah, now... Oh, uh, it's like a damage over time thing, I guess. And yeah, okay, now it poisons you. Uh, so, I don't want to cure the poison yet, because the other one's just going to hatch and hurt me as well. And that sucks. So, let's just deposit some of these. That uh, should be good for now. Yeah. I don't know if there's anything else I can do in here yet. Oh, that's so gross. Jesus. They're like little larva things. So gross. Now, do I risk it and go out to the planter? I'm not going to. I'm just going to use this. Yeah. May have just wasted the green herb if I did, then shit. But that's okay. Because I'm just going to sprint across here and go back upstairs because turning on the power may have triggered something up there. 
Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Well, just wasted a green and a blue herb. So happy about that. I, sh I should have just went for it, or just gone not healed yet, or, yeah, not healed the poison yet. So now I gotta wait for this thing to fucking hatch, and... Come on, monster, kill my let's play. Come on, let's go. Let's go, hatch. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, if I leave the room or go anywhere else, they'll just re respawn. That's why this is one of the most annoying rooms in the game, because it's like a central corridor that you have to go through to get to the save location. You have to go through to get to, you know, a, lots of, a lot of different parts of this map. So, yeah, the fact that every time you just come through here, the moths respawn, and it's possible that this thing won't hatch until I go to a new screen, in which case that is fucking bullshit. So... Let's test that theory. Yeah, either way, this is just killing this Let's Play. This is becoming like... Yeah, I think it's when you go to a new screen. That sucks. Ha, but it didn't poison me. Yes. Good to know. Fuck these things. Fuck them. Fuck them. Fuck them. I hate them. Fuck this camera angle that I can't see it. Fuck... These moths that respawn, I'm just going to run for it. No! <laughs> I'm dying on the inside right now. Yeah. I remember doing this now. This, this has happened before. This has happened before. Uh, I, I want to be careful. I don't know if the poison will kill me. So, I'm going to be frugal and save blue herbs. And, uh, let's try that again. That fucking sucks. Yeah, hopefully this Let's Play doesn't just become, like, healing poison. Okay, there's a third. Where is it? Yeah, this fucking camera angle, I can't even see where it is. So, I can blindly fire bullets. I think I hit it. Yeah, I hit it. Nice. Oh, it's still alive, though. Actually, why kill it? They're just gonna respawn. Yeah. Good call, Frank. Good call. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna label part seven the uh, healing poison edition, because that's that's basically what this is gonna be. It looks like, and that sucks. Uh, let's see. Oh, you know what? Now I, I think uh, yeah, I think I can go in here now. I forgot about this room up here. There's like a little thing off to the side. What is it? What is it? Ah, not that way. Yeah, I am just... I am just blanking right now. This is the part of the game I don't know as well. And you actually do go back to the island eventually, and, uh... If capture just stopped, I'm gonna scream. Capture did not just stop. Thank God for that. Uh, this guy might break out now? No. Yeah, you do eventually go back to the island, and, uh, once I go back there, I'll kind of be in familiar territory again, because I've played that part of the game much more than I played this part of the game. I thought this guy was supposed to... Something, you're supposed to do something that triggers him to break out. And I guess that was not it. So, turning on the power does not do it. Yeah, I can't open the door or anything. So not here. And honestly, if this last room doesn't have anything, then I don't really know what I'm going to do because I have no clue where to go next. I got a gas mask. Uh, yeah, I got a gas mask. What else? What else do I do? That didn't help. Uh, pfft. Jesus, I have no idea. It's funny to me that the, the map for the plane, well, even that they made a map for the plane because it's two rooms, but also that they save it. So like the map for the plane, you never go back on that plane, by the way, it, it crashed and was destroyed. But the fact that they like save it is just hilarious to me. 
It's like in case you ever need to refer back to that one part of the game where there's that one boss fight and you're in like two rooms. Yeah, in case you ever need to refer back to that, you can. Hmm. Uh, nothing in here looks like. Awesome. Everything is awesome. Everything is cool when you're part of a team. I have no idea where I'm going. Shout out to the Lego movie. Watch that on an airplane. One of the better movies I've watched on an airplane. You know, because airplane movies usually suck. Uh, like, what was that? What was that movie, the sequel to... Uh, Sequel to Knocked Up. Well, not like a f like the unofficial sequel to Knocked Up with the same characters. I forget what it was called, but I watched that on a movie. That movie was fucking terrible. Especially because Knocked Up is so funny, too. Um, yeah, but the Lego movie I watched on a plane, it's actually, for being a plane movie, it's actually pretty good. Ah, Jesus. Okay. What the fuck do I do here? Uh, uh, do I have any items I can use? Let's check. Empty extinguisher. Can't use that yet. Empty guns. Ink ribbon. Healing items. Okay, I have nothing. That's locked. Gotta get that item first. I could have sworn there was something you do with this computer, but I guess not. Or like something with a drawer? No. That's not it. Something, something. Okay. Uh, hmm. Yeah. It's a real pickle. I don't know. Oh, fucking really? I'm out of pistol ammo. This is a joyous occasion. I think it would be next to impossible to hit these moths with the bow gun. I it, maybe I could do it, but I would end up wasting so many bolts. And you you want to kind of save the bolts for uh, I got poisoned again. So go back in here, yeah. See, yeah, you kind of want to save the bolts for uh, for turning into explosive. Please, no. <laughs> get away from me. Oh, this this part's a disaster. Th this this part is just like the disaster edition. Oh, I can't believe all of this is happening to me right now. <sighs> Hurry up and hatch, you bastards! Can't do anything here. Mm. The door up there is locked. I don't have like a key or anything. Sorting device. I feel like you could crawl inside the sorting device or something, but maybe not. I'm poisoned again. Awesome. Yeah, I thought you could, but maybe not. Can't use that again. Hurry up and hatch. Fuck. You a fuck! Go heal poison. Again, I don't know what it does if you don't heal it right away, but better safe than sorry because, man, would it be a shame to lose all the progress I've made in this part? Okay, come on. Hurry, 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 hurry. Go, 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 go. No. Uh, no, I'm just done. I'm done. I don't care. If the poison kills me, whatever. I don't care. Actually, I do care, though. Ah. Uh... Because I, you know, despite how terrible this part's been, hopefully this thing just doesn't poison me. Yes! Okay, nice. Dodge a bullet there. Yeah, despite how terrible this part's been, um, I guess it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world to lose this, but eh, still, you know, I, I've done what I've done so far. I w wouldn't want to lose it. I should actually probably cut it soon anyway, so... Uh, no, I won't. I won't. I will... I'll cut this part out, I guess. Um... Blah, of course. Uh... Ah, blah. I guess I can't use anything here. 
the lift station, but it stopped upstairs. Jesus Christ, where do I go? I'm trying to think. I, I just got nothing. I got nothing. Really got nothing. Really got nothing. Let's try in here. Yeah, this is this is kind of what Resident Evil is uh, for people who have never played it before. It's a lot of this, just like running around. I have no idea what to do. I don't know what item I'm supposed to use next. Because a lot of it is just kind of connecting the dots for the most part. So you get one item, you got to find where you use that item to get the next item and so on and so forth. So at this point, can't use that. I have no goddamn idea. Uh, there is a way to get up top. I don't know if I can do it yet. Let's check this room again. Nothing, nothing. I feel like this camera angle means something, but I guess not. Nothing. Nothing, nothing. Can't use this. Already working. Sometimes you just run around and mash X. That's like the, the thing that you do. Uh, just see if you can like pick something up somewhere if you miss something. Okay, I guess nothing here. <laughs> oh god. This is my nightmare. This is actually my nightmare right here. Go through here. On a positive note, I think I solved the reason why my capture kept dropping. And, uh... Yeah, I think I think I fixed it for good. So that's pretty cool. You know, it's the, it's the you gotta take pride in the little things, small victories, just every step of the way, all that stuff. Nothing useful. Can I use this yet? What what does this do? This gas does nothing. Spider's still alive in here. There's a gap. Okay. I feel like also I was I used to be able to like drop down there, but I guess not. Oh, maybe here? No. Uh, I wonder, Claire, what kind? What kind? What? Maybe the kind that's in the room with you right now? Just a thought. Oh my God! Where the fuck do I go? To Google. 20 minutes later. Hey guys, welcome back. So I haven't used the website GameFAQ. That's Game FAQs. I haven't used that in like 15 years, but I don't even know if it's still updated. I just looked up a guide to this game on the original Dreamcast, and I think I know what I got to do now. So that was a little bit of a blast from the past. Uh, that's that's what you know in the oh, fuck I forgot in the early days of the uh, internet before. You know, before, well, I, I don't know. I guess you don't really get stuck in games anymore, really. I don't know. Now that I'm thinking about it, I don't really remember the last time I was stuck in a game. Wait, what? Okay. Okay, a little bit of a jump cut there. Uh, I am such a goddamn idiot. Oh my god. It even tells you, like, oh, it looks like something was dragged back here. So, yeah. I could have done that, like, last part, even. Oh, my God, mouse. I knew that was happening. I actually didn't remember it, but I just looked it up on GameFAQs, and that's how I knew. And there's, like, a thing in here. Yeah, butler. So, uh... I think, long story short, the gist of that letter is that Alfred is a terrible person and he experimented on his own father. Actually, I may have just spoiled like a big reveal later on, but that thing down there, that's Alfred's dad. Yeah. Fucked up, no? 
Yeah, actually, yeah, I don't think you know what that is yet. But yeah, it, it you find out later that Alfred was like, hey, dad, fuck you. I'm going to like test stuff on you. Uh, so yeah, that's what he's doing. Plant pot. What the fuck do I use this for? Oh, that's right. While I'm doing this, I get the uh, pleasant sounds of his moaning down there. Yeah, that's right. Always check the bottom of a plant pot. That's usually where people hide. All right, where's the machine room? I think it's upstairs. It's usually where people hide, like, their spare keys to their houses. So if you're trying to break in somewhere, steal from people, petty theft and all that stuff, that's where it usually is. Hopefully I can get through this without being poisoned. I hate you guys so much. I hate you guys so much. Oh, now you now you trigger. What happened to triggering when I go into the next room? Huh? Bastard. I'm going to take some blue herbs with me because this is just getting ridiculous. Uh, yeah, I'm poisoned already. Uh, what else was I going to say? I don't know. I have no I don't even fucking know anymore, dude. Uh I'll find out if you can use blueers by themselves. Yeah, this this part is just gonna be like jump cut central. There's gonna be so many cuts in this. Guess I have my work cut out for me. I wanted to post this tonight, but it's not looking like that's gonna happen. Okay, so you can use blue herbs by themselves, which is is very nice to know actually. So I wasted that one green herb that I used combined with the blue herb before, but that's okay. Uh, let's see, machine room. Ah, oh, yeah, right. That's right. It's over here. Of a meow. So this door that was locked up here, now I can go through. And just like that, we're back on track. So, little detour there. Now we're good. Use that key. Dispose of that key. I don't know what happens if you say no. I don't know why you would say no. I guess you just have a bunch of useless keys that you have to keep in your box. Uh, I don't know, even know why it gives you the option, to be honest. I guess just because it's an older game, and older games just didn't think about, like, what was easy for the player. They just kind of did stuff for the hell of it. So that, that's probably why. Uh, let's see, what can I do in here? Can I use this? Claire, oh, good. Like there's an Australian observation base about seven miles away from here. That should be our target. Great news, and take a look at that. It's a digging vehicle. If we break the wall with it, we might have a chance. Okay, let's do it. I really hope they don't break that vehicle when they move it right now. Like hit a pipe and release poison gas. That would suck. If Steve like made a mistake right here and kind of fucked everything up, I'll be upset. Yeah, if Steve like got distracted by dat ass and uh, ran this into a poison pipe, that would just be unfortunate. Oh, Steve. Please just leave him, Claire. No, not worth it. Well, good thing I already have the gas mask. So I can, uh, I forgot what I use it for, but now I can just put it on and go back in there. It's all my fault. Yes, it is. Don't say that. Listen to me. We'll escape from here. Together. What kind of a lame plot device is that, though? Come like, on. seriously, he, he checks out a girl the and then, like, sets off poison up, gas. We'll have a better chance of stopping it. It wasn't, like, some yeah. critically important thing to the mission Steve. happens. It was that he's, like, checking out Don't a girl. Forget. That's that's just Get so lame. Out of here. Together. All right, let's go. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's such a stupid plot device. Uh, oh, maybe I equip it? Can I? No. Maybe I equip. Okay, yeah, equip the gas mask. So. Yeah, it's just a waste of a character. I, I've said it before, and I know I also keep saying that this is the last time we have to see him, and we keep seeing him. But, you know, whatever. Let's go through here. Yeah, I knew there was a way to get up top in these two rooms. 
Yeah, that's right. Okay. Cool. Actually, now, the more I think about it, I think we might be about to leave. Antarctica. Holy shit, I think... Uh, yeah, I think we are. I th Yeah, because you, you come back here again, but I think we're about to leave. Because I just got the, the valve that turns off the poison gas in that room. But I can't really think of what else I would do here. Because... You know, I got the valve that turns off the poison gas. We already found the thing to escape. Uh, and there's a bunch of stuff I can't do here. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I think, I think I'm actually about to leave and I'm... Fuck you. I'm gonna fight a boss, pretty sure. So, in that case, I, I might just cut it here then. Which, uh... Yeah, you know, this part was a little bit rough, but... You know, that's what you get. That's, you know, it's it comes with the territory. Um, although I think I'm out of blue herbs. Which fucking sucks. Oh, I have one left. Good. Well, that means extra work later in the game, but... Whatever. I'll deal with it. Use a first aid spray. A gas mask. Let's get ready for, for the fight. Um, out of pistol bullets. I am really low on resources, actually. Um, yeah, I'm just like really low. Wow. I'll make a triple herb, just so I have two big healing things. Get ready for next part. Uh, what else? Do I want the AK? I think so. Yeah, because I don't want to be, if I am truly fighting a boss, I don't want to be stuck using the four explosive things I have, then the, yeah. So I'll take that, and then, and then save it. Yeah, so this was part seven. Uh, this was interesting, wasn't it? Um, you know, we, we stumbled through it. I wouldn't even say stumbled, I would say barely crawled. You know, with, with both legs being shot out from under us, but... Uh, we made it through part seven, and uh, yeah, tune in next week for part eight. So this is Frank from Building the Epic signing off.